Hey everybody, Music Pirate 1103 here. <clears throat> Today is another reaction video, to, but to Duck in the Water UK and US. So let's start and hope you enjoy. Duck in the water. Duck in the water. <clears throat> it was a cold, wet winter's day. Duck was at Napford Station when James arrived. Of all the jobs he is given, James likes pulling coaches best of all. He's a show. It's, it's a shame, shame you've been stuck with a good trained duck, but I suppose somebody has to pull cars. Oh, I thought you sometimes pulled crooks too. That may be, but splendid looking engines such as myself should always pull passengers. Duck is my favorite engine, by the way. After all, the passengers prefer it. James is a show on. He's rude. But I like him now. Thunder rumbling. Rain falls. don't always turn out the way James would like them to. Oh, who can appreciate my bright red paintwork in this weather? Solo. What a flood. The rivers were high. Yeah, it could collapse the bridge. Harold was flying over Duck's branch line. When he saw that the track had been flooded, that's bad. So he went, went towards the top of controller, but it was too late. Uh oh. Oh, Duck. You're cold. Your firebox is out. James was just settling down to have a rest when he saw the top of controller coming, coming across, across the yard. yard. Uh oh, I hope he's not looking to give me another job. Ah, James, you have no job at the moment. Duck is stuck in the flood water and needs to be lifted out. But I'm waiting for my next passenger train, sir. Well, you'd better get going then. The quicker you rescue Duck, the sooner you'll be back! James, don't complain, just help him. But sir, if Duck fell in the water, whose fault is that? It's nobody's fault, James. It was an accident. But I need an engine to take Rocky and help him out. Huh, I thought Ducks liked being in the water. James! Yeah, James. James didn't think fetching Rocky was a very suitable job for a splendid engine mm -hmm. such as himself. But sometimes, every engine has to do a job that they don't mind. Rocky's helping another incident. That ought to do it! Come on, Rocky! We, we have, have to rescue Duck! Oh, okay, James, but you'll have to wait while I have my crane on secured. Wait to secure him. Duck is stuck in the water, and the sooner we get him out, wait. The sooner I can get back to doing something more suitable. James. Hey, James. Whoa. Before Rocky's crane on had been secured. James. He's heavy. That that looks dangerous. There are some ducks flying across him. Oh, that's bad. A water tower. He might have scratched it. Oh, that's bad. He scared the wind. Then, as they approached the flooded track, mm -hmm. James saw a signal that warned him to slow down. Slow down, James. Good. Ooh! Oh, what was that? What was what? I knocked something over. I'm sure it couldn't have been anything important. But a signal is very important indeed. Of course it is. It helps the engines keep safe. Without the signal, there could be accidents. Hurry up! It's cold and wet in here. 
keep your steam in, Duck. We're coming to rescue you. I don't have any steam, James. The water has put out my firebox. James had to position Rocky in front of him for the rescue. <laughs> It's a joke. James thought this was very funny. Even though he knew Duck wasn't real. Yeah. Duck is neither my real name. My real name is Montague. There they go. Meanwhile, Oliver was coming along. And then there's trouble. Too, but he didn't see any signal warning him to stop or slow down. It was knocked down. Watch out, Oliver. Stop, Oliver. That was bad. You... Luckily, nobody was hurt. Ducks in the water again. But James was <laughs> very cross. Oliver, why didn't, didn't you look where you were, you were going? There, there was, was a yellow, yellow signal back there. there. I didn't see any signal. Um, please? Can I get out of the water now? Lift him out of the water. Rocky started to lift Duck back out of the water. And Oliver started to back up so that his driver could put up a warning flag. But then there was more trouble. Even more trouble? Oh, it's Percy! By this time, Harold had seen what was going on. Good. And he flew back to fetch the top of the rope. Finally, Duck's At back on the rails. Rocky managed to lift <laughs> Duck out of the water. Yay. Thank you, Rocky. You're welcome, welcome Duck. There comes Harold and Sir Topham Hat. <laughs> so many accidents. How, How could, could this have happened, happened on my railway? railway? I'm, I'm very sorry, sir, sir but, but it must be my fault. fault. I must have knocked down the signal pole. pole. My, my crane, crane arm wasn't secured. secured. And, and I, I was, was swinging, swinging about. about. It, it was, was nobody's, nobody's fault. fault. It, it was, was an accident. I was in a hurry to go, and Rocky wasn't ready, so... 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 Oh, actually, sir, I suppose it was my fault. I didn't give Rocky time to secure his crane arm properly. That's, That's why he was swinging about. I can't say that, that I am very happy about this, James. The signal's not but I am by his crane arm. For admitting what you have done. Perhaps it would be best if you made amends by pulling Duck's cars while his firebox dries out. out. Yes, sir. I'd be happy to. Thank you, James. Pulling trucks may not be his favorite job. And James knows that he can't always do the jobs he likes best. But so long as the but sun James shines, can't always get what he wants. He is a very splendid looking bright red Sometimes you gotta do things you don't wanna do, James. Awesome.